just a normal family. A little awkward, sometimes weird, loud and crazy. Wait, did I say normal? Oops, my bad. Stick around. Get to know us. We have Cheyenne and Tyreek. This is Savannah. I'm Michelle. And this is The Shell Bill Life. Good morning, everyone. It is Saturday. I am up early. I think it's barely eight o'clock and I am going to tackle my room. It's not a complete mess. It just needs to be cleaned. Um, and I'm showing you guys this from a distance because it's a mess. Starting in the bathroom, clean the bathroom, put the towel away and then clean this up and straighten everything up. So as I'm cleaning up my dresser, I just wanted to show you guys how many sample swatches palettes i don't know whatever you want to call them of course i didn't get every single one but i had so many and i think i have some on the other side of my um bed on my nightstand that i gotta go through so yeah and most of these as you've seen did not work out all right everyone so i just finished cleaning my room and i'm actually watching my friend melissa's disneyland vlog again because i miss disneyland so that's what i'm watching right now now that i found a color i'm kind of like not stuck because all i have to do is buy the things and paint but I don't know there's little things I want to do first so I don't know we'll see you guys so I'm going to put that up today hopefully it comes out right because it's a big window and it's way up there you guys know I have a fear of heights so I may have to ask Tyreek to help me with it because I just don't want to mess it up and yeah that's my plans next all right you guys so here is my dining room area and I'm pretty sure I showed you guys how it looks a mess like this before then is watching mega mine up in there a lot of these chairs were from my old dinette set ignore the curtain curtain rod everything all that's going to be changed um, see that window up there and that's what I'm going to attempt to fix and once I get up there I will try to show you guys what I mean about the neighbors window that overlooks my backyard and they would be able to see in here okay i'm just gonna have to show you guys from here see that's their window that they can see into if they looked out there'd be no way i'd be able to get on this ladder <laughs> and raise the camera up there to show you guys because i'm already afraid to do what i'm going to attempt to do y'all pray for me i did it there's a few imperfections because the brand new roll that I bought that still wasn't big enough or wide enough to cover the full window. So I actually had to cut a little piece on the side and you see where the film overlaps, but no one's not gonna really be looking up there. I see it of course, because I just did it and it is bugging me. Um, oh my goodness, but I will show you guys. This is the best that I was able to do being afraid y'all I got on the fourth stair on the ladder I could not believe I did that um yeah I could have had Tyreek help but I wanted it to be done right I guess he could have did it I don't know but let me show you guys it's up there and I don't think they could see in here I mean I see the shape of the house but that's about it and those are the weird ones. A long time ago, I told you guys about neighbors who, they when they come home from work, they'll sit in their car if we're outside or anything like that, or if they were in their backyard swimming because they have a swimming pool over there. I should have shown you guys their pool. I don't know. Anyway, so if they're in the backyard swimming and my kids go outside in our backyard, within five minutes, the whole family goes in. So it's just weird little occurrences like that. And... Yeah, so I'm actually pretty proud of this in spite my imperfections. All right, y'all. So there it is. And it's always bad lighting when I try to show you guys up there. Okay, so, okay, I guess I'll show you guys. See over here where it overlaps? I do have a razor where I'm able to try to fix that, but I'm not. Say bye. Okay. 
Tariq. Okay, sorry, I just had to give him some instruction because you know how us mothers are. Anyway, um, I'm trying to zoom in on it. So see right there where it overlaps and even the top, I don't know if you guys can see that line. Well, right there. That's where I had to cut a small piece to put up there also because I cut that part too low. So yeah, I think I'm actually going to get up there with a credit card and smooth it a little bit more because I see a few bubbles. But yeah, I don't think they can see it, you guys. And I don't know, it just gives off so much more light and I am loving it. I cannot wait until I can show you guys the full reveal of this room because right now it's looking like a whole lot of nothing. Hot mess, actually. So look at all the sample paint I bought. And I still have three more in the kitchen that I bought for these walls. And what I'm supposed to do with this, this was like maybe four, I say anywhere from three to five bucks each. And it's gonna go to waste because I don't know what to do with them. Y'all want some paint? I'll mail it to you. No, really, y'all want some paint? Oh, nope, they're over here. So yeah, I have those four plus all these right here. A lot of money, just wasted. Can y'all believe that when I moved into this house, I absolutely love this green and this whole setup she had. So when I moved in, all of the curtains and blinds and everything that else that was here had to stay because my realtor told me, however you show the house, well not the furniture, but whatever window treatments are on the house, that has to stay. I didn't know, I just was like, okay, so that all stayed and this green here is the last thing that I have not changed out because remember I was doing other rooms in my house, like my living room, my bedroom, stuff like that. So even in Tyreek's room and Cheyenne's room, they have different um, things up than when we, when I bought the house. I really wanna straighten up this room a little bit more and get stuff just cleared out at least. I don't know what I'm gonna do with my Disney puzzles, you guys, so I have a Disney puzzle. Um, I'm not gonna throw it away, of course, because I work too hard at it. And plus, it's Disney, duh, why would I throw it away? I don't know where to put it. I'm not gonna put it in my dining room. And then I have a Little Mermaid, an aerial poster that I had on this wall back here. I don't know what I'm gonna do with those, you guys. Yeah, all right, I'll figure something out. I just wanna clear up this area. This is a mess. Okay, so one paint sample <laughs> that will not go to waste. Remember I told you guys I was going to repaint the yellow in my kitchen because now I feel like the yellow is too bright because I did the floors in here and I don't want to show you guys my floors now, but I just wanted to show you I am in the process of painting. I'm using the sample right there. I'm just painting what I can until I run out of the sample. I want to get the full effect of what it's going to look like when it's completely painted and I am loving it already. You can already tell how it's more calm. The yellow is not as bright as the one on the top and I like this a whole lot better, you guys. So much better, so much more calm. And if you wonder why I did not prime the walls first, it's because I actually like the color it gave off when I put it over the brighter yellow walls. So yay, you guys. I'm gonna continue on this little area right here and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna run out of primer. I mean, not primer, I'm gonna run out of the sample by then.
Okay, you guys are gonna get tired of hearing about my home improvements, but you know how I do once I start. It gives the kitchen a whole different feel and I am loving this. I cannot wait to get started on these bright walls over here, but so far with this, oh yeah. I wish I would have picked this color to begin with. Okay, so this is, I do have a little bit of this color left. This color is called Sunflower Seed. So yeah, I'll just save this for when I get the gallon. Okay, it's 1.30, room is clean, dining room, the privacy glass is put up, house is straightened up, dishes are done, laundry is going, time for a nap. So she's home, let's see if it happened. She can't say I never did this work. Yeah, you're late for work. Did you meet him? <laughs> Okay, oh my gosh, so... You gotta tell everyone. <sighs> okay, not now. I'm still, like, shaking. The, I saw, guess what I saw there? Who? Melissa and, um, and Vanessa and really? um, AJ. Really? Yeah. Yeah, um, I called her and they said that they were, they, yeah, they were there. I called Vanessa. But I saw them, because I was up at top at first, and then I was determined to make my way to that front. And I made it on his Snapchat story. Did you? I I've been looking. Star. I'm on Jeffree Star's Snapchat story. Don't forget to tell her how. Okay, me and Tar okay, Tariq started a chant like Jeffree, Jeff, and he came out. Oh my gosh. We got him to come out. Oh. So you're on his Snapchat story? Yeah, let me show okay. you. Oh, it's right there. I'm right there. <laughs> We literally started that. Okay, so I guess in order to actually meet them, a ticket, right? The tickets were all sold out, of course. Okay. So, um, well, you can also go in the store if you wanted to, but the line was outside. The of mall. course. So we were like, no, because what if he comes right here and we're still in line? Right. So. And then what if by the time that it's over, exactly, you're still in line? Exactly. Okay, so tell him what you just told me. He waved at me, and um, I made eye contact with Shane Dawson. Oh, Cause we were shouting his name. We we're like Shane, Shane, but he didn't come out. But yeah. Yeah. Okay. So has your. And I'm about to go binge watch all his videos. Oh my goodness! You watch all their videos anyway. Well, I know, but like, I'm like, ugh. Like, and and Jeffrey Star last week was with the Dolan twins. He's what? He was with the Dolan twins last week. Oh, I think you told me that. Yeah. Yeah. And so... James Charles made a video with Jeffrey Star. Uh, imagine if it was James Charles. Now that would be worse. It would be like a like a safety thing. So issue. James Charles, I don't know who he is. He, he he's a beauty guru. Oh okay. Oh life. one of those one of those. Um, he's like Jeffrey Star. Jeffrey Star. Yeah. Okay, all them. I don't know their names. I know their faces sometimes when I see them. Y'all, I'm James old. Charles. I don't I don't keep up with all literally, that stuff. Y'all you know, know we don't wear makeup, so. Okay, hold on. Let me show you. You literally know James Charles. You're but play. Savannah watches him. Why do you watch him anyway? He's funny. Because he's love funny. Him. Oh okay. Yeah. This is James Charles. How do you not know James Charles? I I do know him by you the face. Yeah. Yes, but I don't know. I just sister squad. Oh, he's he's he the one that always say hi sister or hey sister. Yeah. yeah. So that's Savannah's experience of yeah. meeting <laughs> Jeffrey Star. Jeff Star come out. You should have pulled your phone out when y'all started chanting. I have that video. I just it's just a lot. I have a lot of videos. So I'm gonna go through them right now. Okay. And yeah, you guys. I will already have probably put the videos on that she's talking about. Mm -hmm. 